black folks, listen up. A lot of y'all like candy yams, but you don't know how to make them. And y'all be boiling them in water, and they be all mushy and shit. And then you bite into the middle of them yams, and then it's like no flavor and shit. And you're like, oh, right there, I need more syrup. I mean, need more syrup. You don't need all that damn sugar if you cook them right. So I'm going to give y'all a quick, quick, yeah, quick shit so y'all can make some good ass candy yams and shit. I'm all glistening and shit. Man. That's that damn face scrub and shit. You know, got to be looking clean and shit. Look, first first thing, you, you want to cut them thin, all right? Cut your candy yams thin. Like, why you cut them so thin? Because look, that's more surface area that's gonna get flavor. All in one bite, look at that. One bite, you're gonna be coated in nice buttery, sugary gooeyness. You know what I'm saying? But y'all be making these, y'all be cutting y'all damn candy yams so damn big, like the flavor can't penetrate. Can't no flavor penetrate through all that yam. You dig what I'm saying? So y'all gotta learn y'all knife skills and shit and cut these shits thin. Look at that, thin. And you say, why you leave the skin on there? Cause that's where all the vitamins, and if you put enough sugar and butter on it, that shit's delicious and shit. All right? Next thing you need to know, if you ain't used to sweet potatoes and shit, they, they produce their own moisture, right? They, they, they got water in them, believe it or not. So when you add water to a pot that releases water when it's cooked, you get water squared. I don't know if that's science, but you get more water in your product than you need to. And if you understand that water tastes like water, for y'all who don't believe me, you see all that liquid you get? Now I ain't adding our now water to these taters. That's why they not candy yet. So now, I got to get all that water to evaporate and then it's going to leave ooey. But right now, I'm just, just stirring my potatoes with that sugary syrup. You dig what I'm saying? You dig what I'm saying? This shit look good. You know what I'm saying? Flavor will make it juicy, you dig? I like, I like my potato like I like my women. Juicy. So I ran out of butter, y'all. Now I could run to the stove, take me 30 minutes, go get some butter and shit. I don't feel like that. They ain't gonna make, they ain't gonna make my mood feel good. So I got a good, a good, um, what's you gonna call it? What's that shit? Yeah, 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 good substitution. Look, 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 look. That's just, oh, you can't even tell in the pot because it done melted. All right, but that's just some coconut oil. All right, we got some coconut oil and some brown sugar. So I'm making my, my sweet potato glaze, you dig what I'm saying? So I got some coconut milk and I got me some brown sugar. I just wanna, I, I just wanna let y'all know like, sugar, I mean I like sugar, it's just, it's just delicious. But in order to taste the sugar, like to really, like, like, really like, oh this shit's delicious. What you wanna do is you wanna add some contrast to your food. You did, see like things like cinnamon, Nutmeg, allspice, those, those, they not, they don't contrast sugar. They, they um, go with, they complement, they complement the sugar. You did, but you need something to go against the sugar. You know what I'm saying? That way you feel it, like, bam. So what we gonna do a little, get a little, little dab, dab, dab. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna throw a little bit of that cayenne in there. Just a little, just a little bit of heat to make the sweet sweet. You dig what I'm saying? It's like, like you got a girl, you can't be just nice to her all the time. You gotta be like, man, fuck that shit sometimes. So that way she appreciate your sweetness and shit, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, you you be too nice, the motherfucker be taking you for granted. So you gotta throw a little bit of heat up in that sweet so they dig what you talking about, you dig? See that right there? That's how you know you you, you candy and you see them little bit of bubbles and it, it's turning into a syrup. And then the last little bit, little, little, I know it ain't much, but we gonna add us a little, a little joint of rum in that motherfucker right there, you see what look like that? You know what I'm saying? They, they got that comeback, you know what I'm saying? So now, we're gonna take this glade right here. We're gonna pour that over them sweet potatoes there. Man, that shit. Look, look, look. Don't, don't eat this shit around your mama. Mad as hell. She be like, damn, how, how did your nigga sweet potato taste better than mine? Cause I do this. Ooh, shit, 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 boy. Ooh, go 
Don't pull some of that on, 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 on the wall and shit. Probably serving diabetes to anybody who want to die early and happy. Uh, <laughs> oh, shit. Good, good, good cooking today. Boy, this, this is the best song right here. Look at this. Oh, this is so, oh, so sticky and sweet. Boy, I just pulled it. Look, I just pulled it right here on somebody's neck. Some daughter's, somebody's daughter's neck. You got to be old enough, though. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm playing bullshit. Yeah.